Hey, what is up guys? And today I have the Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge and the Gear VR headset right here. So I'm gonna do one of my very first phone unboxings, a legit unboxing, and uh, hopefully you guys enjoy. So um, let's get to it. Okay, so here's the box. I don't have a machete like Flossie Carter does, um, but I simply have a pair of scissors. So that should do, it's just tape. And uh, there'll be no beast mode, unfortunately, as I'm a little bit worried of damaging the S7 Edge. But um, I'm really pumped to get this out. I'm really excited. It does come with the VR headset, the Gear VR, which was free. It was included because I pre-ordered it. And um, I got the Platinum Gold Edition. And it's the S7 Edge, as you will have known from the title. But um, I'm definitely really excited. Um, so let's just see what's in the top here. So I'm presuming this big box, yep, this is the Gear VR, so that looks pretty good. Works with your S6 Edge, your S6 Edge Plus, it works with your Note 5, and obviously your S7 and S7 Edge as well. It's made by Oculus, and um, I'll definitely be doing a video on this, it looks really, really good, and I'll be giving that a try really soon. So, I have some paperwork and documentation, that's pretty boring stuff, but here's the box. Now, whoa, I'm already impressed by the look of the box. Um, Samsung really have stepped up the game. I really didn't like that wooden box that they used to do. It used to look really cheap, but this is a really premium box and it does have a good feel to it. It looks pretty nice. As you can see that I've got the 32 gigabyte. I don't even think you can get any other memory specification because you have the SD card. But on the back here, we have some specifications. Four gigabytes of RAM. I have the 64 bit octa core processor. I have uh, 4G LTE and the uh, 12 megapixel sensor, 5 megapixels on the front, IP68 water and dust resistant, and all that other stuff, fast charging and everything else. So it looks really good. Um, so let's get into the actual box of the phone. Now it's European SIM cards only for some reason, but I'm fine because I'm in the UK. Hopefully we don't leave and then I won't be able to use the phone. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. But um, I would have thought the sticker would have been a little bit easier to take off. Um, it's a little bit of a pain, to be honest. It looks kind of a mess now, and I've kind of screwed it up. Does this come off? Nope, that just looks worse. Okay, we're going to try cut it. So, let's try. Damn, this is actually pretty hard to get into, guys. I'm not going to lie. Yep, I definitely am struggling. Let me try this way. Okay, I, j I just skipped it um, because it was just really difficult to get into, and you guys don't want to see me struggle for ages. Uh, that was long enough, but getting into the box, here it is, the gold platinum Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. Now, it looks stunning. The light reflection on it just looks amazing. It actually looks kind of like silver from my angle. Uh, from the front on and the camera as well, it makes it look more gold than it actually is, but it's more of like a silvery, kind of like a mirror color. You will see it when I turn it sideways that it actually looks more like a silver, like a sort of a more of like a platinum color uh, in the name platinum gold but it but it isn't definitely um it's not like a, a yellow strong gold but it's like a shiny kind of silvery um with like a tint of gold to it or it's like kind of kind of like a champagne gold uh, but maybe like a bit lighter um but it is really nice and uh whoa this looks stunning but taking a look in the box we have the kind of plastic cover here uh for the camera hump we have a hole and uh, that's got a reduced camera hump as well so i'm looking forward to having a look at that, as well as doing some camera tests for you guys. So, how do I get into this? I'm presuming this is documentation, and it is. We got the weird tool to remove your SIM card and SD card slot, and you have your quick guide, your region locks instructions, and you also have the instructions on the OTG cable, which you get with it. Now, I did think these earphones actually look black, and Jonathan Morris from TLD actually thought that too. They really do look black for some reason, but they're not. They're, they're just the white ones with a different ear cup, and uh, they're in a black case. But at least we get a case. That is a good thing, and I'm, I'm, I'm quite excited to try out how the stock headphones sound. I'm not really. I'm kind of interested in the phone more, and I'm presuming you guys are too. But we get the quick charge, the plug. This is the UK plug, by the way. And we got our cable, which is thinner. This, the cable wire itself is actually thinner, and uh, we get the OTG um, micro USB to regular USB port adapter. So there's no USB-C, but um, this is included so we can plug in memory sticks, other devices, keyboards, drives, anything like that into our phones, which is neat. So it just simply goes in the bottom, 
and we can plug anything we want in there that's USB and it'll pretty much work, you can guarantee it. Um, but yeah, it, it did actually come with 0% for some reason, which is unusual, so I'm actually charging it right now, but I'm gonna give it a quick test when it's done and um, I'll let you guys know. Okay, so I've been playing it around with it a little bit and um, I've already got my stock kind of theme on it from the Samsung theme store, so it does look kind of minimalistic and um, it came with that wallpaper and everything and it's changed a bunch of apps, but um, it does look nice. I actually am not that keen on the Samsung TouchWiz. Uh, the camera's great. I really want to just play around with it a bit and I'll have a final review coming out, but this is just my quick unboxing of it. It's really snappy so far. The screen is amazing as you can tell from the video. Not really, but um, as you can tell from many other Samsung phones, they have amazing screens and this one does too. Now I only have 33% because I haven't actually charged it that much. I couldn't wait to use it and set it up, but I will be charging it and doing a review in the future. But anyway guys, that is it. The gold looks stunning. Hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Thank you very much for watching.